my goodness. Good morning, everybody. It's Friday. It you is Friday. You made it an entire week sitting beside me. I did. Now, an I'm, entire week. And I'm, I'm already <laughs> hearing from some of the viewers. Uh oh. They say that, uh -oh. that the new guy's boring. No. So, so I'm going to work on that today, Amber. So, <laughs> is that what you're going to yeah. work on? <laughs> well, also, we're going to get maybe a plug for you because you're looking for a barber. I, I am. Yes. I'm, and I'm kind of leaning towards somewhere. I live in Carmel. In Carmel, Carmel so, area. Uh, so I want to, and I want an affordable barber. There so, you go. You know. It's not going to break the bank. Yeah, I mean, right. you know, Scott was telling me that he gets his hair cut someplace that was, yeah. I don't, I don't want to pay that much, every, doesn't every, pay that much. every every hey, two weeks. Hey, you and I are both budget so, conscious. Yes, we I are. I understand that. Yes. And then Randy fits in quite nicely with that as well. Yeah. This is going to be quite the trio, I'm telling you, once he gets back, and he's back on Monday. Oh, good. I'm so looking forward to that. So there you go. But yeah. yeah, hey, welcome, everybody. My goodness, it's Friday, November 19th. So coming up this morning on Indie Style, I love this. This is sort of a meal with a mission. Andrew, Andrew Kaplinger is here from Kaplinger's Fresh Catch. So, Andrew, I understand you're making bacon wrapped colossal shrimp, is this right, and scallops, but also using the Moselle Sanders barbecue sauce. Yes, yeah, we're going to be uh, cooking that up in the kitchen today, and it's going to be pretty spectacular. Yeah, so. show me a little something. I'm going to pan that camera down because I want to see. Those <laughs> shrimp are giant. Yeah. The scallops wrapped in bacon. George, did you come hungry today? I, I, I've learned. Yes, <laughs> I am hungry. I'm ready for some bacon for breakfast. Yes, that looks delicious. And then, of course, we'll learn the reason behind why we're doing this today and the importance as well. Andrew, thank you so much. We'll see you coming up here in just a little bit. Now, we've got a question for you this morning. Uh, Oh, okay. What do the Lumineers, okay. Cage the Elephant, okay. and Neil Young have in common? Have no well, idea. those <laughs> artists have all influenced Ross Hollow. That indie-based band there is in are. the studio this morning, poised to share their yes. unique brand of folk-focused rock yeah, ahead, ahead of a launch party tonight. Da -na 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 -da, da -na -na -da. I love that sound. Very nice, friend. And then I also coming out. Just make sure I tap the foot. Doesn't yes. It? A little dance, a little bit. So our community is coming together to help dogs in need. We have Grateful Rescue Sanctuary. They are here. They are working to turn a really heartbreaking story. Oh my goodness, grab the tissues. But they're turning it into a message of hope, which is what we love here yes, on Indie Style, right? Giving back and helping those in need, uh, especially when they are our furry friends. Look at Miss Paisley there. And, and Bella. Bella. Oh. And Bella. So and should we, should we fill them in on the question today? Let's the do it. Because quest George, question. there are opinions. Yes, there are. Yes. We're already hearing from folks. The question yes. brought to you by Kitchen Saver custom cabinet renewal what do you think of green bean <laughs> casserole george i love it uh, well i do too there are some green bean uh, casserole haters out there they I, do not well I, and i told you earlier i, I was I've been shut down on green bean casserole for this year. Yeah, that's okay. So, yeah, but, but I bet we can find somebody to make it here on Indie Style. Uh, Bonnie says, I love it as long as someone else is making it. So Bonnie doesn't want to cook in the kitchen, George. Uh, apparently, she wants someone else actually, to do the green work. bean casserole is sort of an it easy thing. It is kind of an know, easy yeah, thing. Yeah, it is. Cindy hates it. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Cindy. I love fresh green beans, but this just makes them taste like mush. Okay, so I think if you mm -hmm. maybe make it a different way, it yeah. doesn't have to be like mush. But Melody says, born and raised here in Indiana, all I can think is this was brought by somebody's sweet little elderly aunt, and no one had the heart to tell her it was for it. This is this this is oh, I'm, I'm a little surprised by the um, <laughs> by the tone of some of these. It can be so good, but I will say, on Melody's note. Not maybe not everybody makes it the same or as good as it should be or maybe as what you were used to. And, uh, you know, if you're having problems with it, I would suggest add some bacon. Just bacon Just makes everything bacon better, makes doesn't everything it? Better. Bacon Andrew makes Kaplinger everything backs us up better. On that. Yeah. So you know what also makes everything better? Maybe like cupcakes, sweets. Speaking of, I have a book signing, you guys, on Saturday, oh, right. and you're going to be able to get to have a sweet treat. So this is another book signing for Curly Keys. Curly Keys, go away. I hope you guys are going to be able to make it. The weather doesn't seem too bad. It's a nice long stretch, 9 to noon, so, so you can too. drop in and yes. meet Amber Hankins. And the little girl, Avery, of course, my little okay. daughter. This is going to be at Sweet Pages in Brownsburg. And I say cupcakes because, you guys, she is making a cupcake called the Avery. Okay. A strawberry cupcake, George, with glitter and sprinkles. All right, How and, cute is and we're, that? we're getting a talent fee for Avery on this, right? Of course, because okay. you are her agent now. Yes, I am. Yes, I'm a representative. <laughs> just to make sure. And I get 6% of all exactly. of it. Exactly. Yeah, okay. Exactly. Yeah. We might bump that up depending on how well she does. So there <laughs> right. we go. But hey, also a quick note we want to talk Moselle Sanders mm -hmm. because Wish TV is proud to once again team up with the Moselle Sanders Foundation. It's all about feeding thousands of family this Thanksgiving. It is the group's 50th year offering Thanksgiving meals. And of course, we want you to join us as well. All you have to do is text Moselle to 3 
313131 to donate. Every $20 will feed a family of four. You can also grab your phone and scan that QR code on your screen for more information on how you can volunteer. But really cool, George, the goal this year to feed 15,000 families. That's amazing. It is indeed.